Oh, hello wild ones. I'm here for a stealth camp in this lovely fallen tree. Hello wild ones. So I'm here in this beautiful fallen tree. I've got to keep a low profile today because there are paths and people on all sides. In fact, there's a path just there behind this tree, really close. And the others are all a bit further away but still within viewing distance so I am expecting it to be see that's someone with their dog whistle now um, I'm expecting it to be really cold tonight so we're gonna make it nice and cozy let's make it just there okay so for tonight I've got my DD super light up and I'm gonna put that between these two branches here and I've got some camo netting as well well, that'd be quite fun, so let's get started. So if I tie this on by this point here, that gives me gives me perfect coverage and a little flap on the side here to give me some protection from a breeze coming in from that direction. Yeah. I'm going to try and use one of these points onto a branch to lift this roof up slightly. Let's have a look from the path. See where we want to use the camo netting. So this is the nearest path. My shelter is just there. And it's the only one that I really want to be hidden from because I'm quite close to it. So I can see my tarp at the moment. I think I'm gonna use the camo netting on this side to conceal it a little bit. Let's do that. believe how busy <laughs> it is in this woods today right let's go have a look around there now that the camera netting is up and see if we're a bit more hidden back on the path again yeah that is much better let's see i wouldn't notice that there's my little camp in there you're just not going to see it from the path yay cool much quieter now I've not seen anyone else in over an hour I think so that's lovely I think everyone's gone home for their tea it's still got it's half six a couple hours till it's gonna get dark so I'm gonna get my bed all ready and just chill and watch the sun go down the woods are so pretty this time of night
Look at it. I can't really put into words how it feels this time of day to be alone in the woods with the sun going down. It's real special. It feels like freedom, you know? Dark now. Let's get me a little light on. Yeah. Cozy. It is a bit chilly already. It's four degrees something. I think I'm gonna get in my bag now and just chill out for a little while till I'm ready for my dinner. I've got some tasty rice and some pork for tea. Yeah, it's so lovely being out here in the fresh air, nice and quiet. I've set an alarm for the morning though because it's so busy around here. I want to be up before sunrise, so I'll be awake at 6.20 tomorrow and packed up nice and early, or at least up and awake before the dog walkers are about. The munchak are out. Hi, friends. They're quite close. Dinner today is some tikka rice and got some pork that I cremated earlier. Yay! I've been hearing the weirdest sound tonight. I'll try and catch it next time it happens. It's like a really low mm, mm, sort of noise. again could you hear it it's one of those nights that you don't need a head torch because the moon's so bright and the trees are casting moon shadows across the ground it's so quiet it's eerily quiet actually i've got a little bit of heebie-jeebies tonight <laughs> which i don't usually have i think because it was so busy earlier I get worried that I was seen and mind starts playing tricks for me. I think I'm gonna get to bed now, I'll try and get some sleep and I'll see you guys for sunrise. Bye! Good morning. It's a beautiful morning. The bird song has been absolutely gorgeous. I slept for about six hours last night, which is really good actually. I wasn't expecting to sleep so well. I was a bit on edge. I didn't sleep very deeply, but I had a nice six hours sleep, so that's good. It's freezing this morning outside and one degree in my little shelter, so a whole degree of difference actually makes quite a difference to sleep in. I've been toasty and warm all night, it's been lovely. My hand warmer in here somewhere, so. Love that. It's been going all night. So toasty. So I think I'm gonna have this and then get packed up. I haven't seen anyone yet this morning, but probably it won't be long. People milling about everywhere. It's getting really hard down south to find places to camp away from road noise and people. Actually, it's impossible. I came here to get away from the road noise in my usual spot, but it's so busy. And it is doable, but it does put me a bit on edge. I had people walking right past my shelter yesterday. I don't know if I was seen or not because I was hiding. I'm gonna get going you guys. Thanks for watching and see you again soon. Bye!